Welcome to Variant Analysis, Ingenuity's secure online platform for interpreting human genomes. In this overview, we'll walk through the basics of the platform, covering key concepts of sample, analysis, filters, and sharing, all to help you get started with your own free private account. When you log into Variant Analysis, you'll see everything in three main folders, My Samples, My Analyses, and Publications. Let's start with My Samples. A sample is a whole or partial genome of a person or tissue that's been sequenced, aligned, and called. To get samples in your account, you can upload them directly, say in VCF, or a colleague can share them to you from their account. Once you've got samples, you can use variant analysis to annotate and compare any set of them to find candidate variants, genes, and pathways for any phenotype. To analyze samples, wrap them together and click. Variant analysis will ask a few simple questions on phenotype, study type, and so forth. It handles many kinds of studies, from families to tumors to big cohorts. And don't worry about answering perfectly. Your answers loosely set up the analysis, but you can change them later and get updated findings on the fly. When you're ready, just click Analyze. You'll get an email when it's done. Next, let's open My Analyses to walk through a completed one. Clicking on an analysis opens it for you to review and refine. The big table you'll see lists candidate variants, genes, or pathways in your data, depending on what level you're searching. Here, each row is a chromosomal site called with a non-reference variant in these samples, with columns detailing much more about that variant, what gene or regulatory segment it may be in, functional effects, etc. This column graphically summarizes the genotypes at each site in your case and control samples for easy scanning. Clicking on a candidate variant or gene or pathway in those lists pops up lots more detail, such as a simple graphical summary of why the Ingenuity Knowledge Base thinks this variant may be relevant to your studied phenotype. Your short list will reflect how the analysis filtered your data via the filter cascade over here. Each filter helps answer one of three key questions about each variant. First, is the variant real by upstream call confidence scores, etc.? Second, who has the variant in the world at large through thousand genomes, etc., and at the right zygosity in your cases or control? And third, what does it do by affecting the makeup or amount of particular gene products and how those in turn interact to shape phenotypes relevant for your study? You can tweak, add, drop, or move filters to suit your own study design and phenotypes. And you can even annotate samples and genome segments with your own data on kinship, gene expression, linkage mapping, and so forth. Crucially, you can also easily share samples and findings in variant analysis. Just click Share, type your colleague's email address or pick from the list, and send. This handy feature is sparking collaborative discoveries by our users, some of which are already published here in the Publications tab. That covers the basics of variant analysis. Other videos and the help box and info button scattered throughout the app dive deeper into particular features to help you best leverage the platform in your work. Now have fun digging into your genomes and let us know how we can help.